in search of simple beauty, a bit of a reset, I came to Kangbing, a city full of romance in Shambhala. The beautiful mountains and rivers and magnificent scenery made me feel Shambhala personally in my bones and made me want to travel every inch of China. I'm going up Palma Mountain. Uh, it's over 2,000 meters tall. I don't know exactly how tall, but uh, I've heard that at the top there are people who still sing the uh, old Kangding love song, traditional song. So I'm really excited to go see if I can meet any locals and, and talk to them and just learn more about this beautiful location. Some cities are remembered, made famous, or enhanced by a moving song, a catchy tune passed down by word of mouth from generation to generation. Just like Hotel California or Sweet Home Alabama, Kangding similarly is famous for its Kangding love song, which combines the melody of multiple traditional folk songs, concise but rich. Although simple, in the 1970s, Kangding love song was selected as one of NASA's 10 most iconic songs in the world, all of which were played in space by the Voyager 2 probe. The song's beautiful melody is infectious, something you'll undoubtedly feel when you listen carefully. We left the city and drove up a winding, narrow mountain road for a few miles, not too far from the city, about half an hour or so. Made it to Jodhua Mountain. This is a, uh, uh, just a famous peak here in near Kangding. Look at some of these flags, see if we can see a little bit of the text up in person. Come to the home of a of a you know Tibetan family. The Tibetans here are far more accessible and hospitable than I expected. I'm very curious about the decoration of this home. Mm. Oh wow. So, so for these walls, I was just curious that they're, they're always so beautiful. Uh, most of these, these designs are actually painted by a local painter who is from, you know, this area, which I think is, is kind of beautiful. I mean, it's very impressive, you know, it has all these different kind of imagery and, you know, each, the way I look at it, like each panel has a different animal. I don't know, I just find it so beautiful. So we got an elephant, monkey, rabbit, uh, we got sort of like, you know, traditional like lions and tigers and all sorts of animals. My trip to Kangding has come to an end. I came to Yuzhi. Made it to Yuzhi, over 4,000 meters tall. And from here, you can see, as far as I can see, it's mountains in every single direction. Whites and greens and, and reds and browns and every color you could imagine. And this is, uh, this is heaven, baby. Woo! Perhaps I never lost my way. So I walk in the snow, unaware exactly where I am or where north I be. Just being present in the moment is enough. I think I still feel it in my heart. There's a tall lighthouse guiding me. Now it's time for me to find my next location to share more stories with you all. Goodbye, everyone.